What you are looking at is what we call an installation of 18 blown glass boats by the Italian artist Lino Talia Pietra. Each of the boats is suspended from the ceiling by a steel cable and they float in the air much like the gondolas of Talia Pietra's native Venice float on the water. In fact, the boat form, called a canoa, is actually based on the gondola, which is also an impossibly elongated, light and efficient boat. Talia Pietra had a classic European education. He entered the glass factories of Murano, Venice's glassmaking island, at the age of 11. He earned the title of maestro at 21, and he worked for several companies making objects and doing some design, but it was not until he came to America that he developed his own sculptural work. In 1979, when he was 45, he boarded his first plane to the United States. He came at the invitation of Dale Chihuly, a very well-known American glass artist, to teach at Chihuly's school in Washington State called Pilchuck Glass School. After 1979, he returned to the United States every year and also traveled abroad to teach students Venetian glass blowing techniques. What Talia Pietra did was open a path onto centuries of glass knowledge for American artists. And after his arrival in the United States, it is not an exaggeration to say that glass blowing was changed forever.